Well, we're at uh, Scale Nationals, you know, in Alabama. We haven't been out here before. I got uh, seven, six of my teammates here from Team G Speed Chassis. Uh, we're checking out the first uh, few drivers going through course, um, checking our lines out, and we, we think it's going to be a good day. A lot of technical lines, a lot of, a lot of holes you're dipping in and out of. Uh, but we're to, uh, we we got a plan. About the traction and the terrain here on this style of rock because you're all the way from the west coast. Well, we're we're, we're from the west coast, but fortunately, uh, our, our backyard training ground is Rock City on Mount Diablo, which is uh, about 40 uh, minutes east of San Francisco, and it has a lot of the same sandstone. It has some moss coverage like this, and it's a little more inconsistent than this rock that we have here. Uh, but it's it's very similar, so I think that's going to help us out in um, you know picking our lines. This this place has a little more dips and bowls um, that we need to watch out for, um, but it, it's very grippy. What uh, do you have anything you want to shout out that's coming out from G Speed? I saw you just got the new shop and you're doing the interior crawler course in there, which is yeah, actually amazing. not an interior. So yeah, we got the G Speed uh, performance shop going to be opening up. Uh, to the public probably in about three weeks or so. We're delaying a little bit because of scale nationals in these big events. Uh, but we got about uh, 11, 12 tons of rock that's going to be set outside. And this is going to be, we're going to have comps there. It's going to be our training grounds. And uh, we're going to actually have trucks to, uh, for uh, newcomers to rent so they can see how these trucks work. And then we'll also have uh, 10.2s and TRX4s with G-Speed chassis on them so they can see the benefits of what we have to offer. So if you're going to do outside, that means 12 tons of rock. I'm a trail builder, so I understand what 12 tons of rock looks like and what it feels like when you move it. That's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> um, that means you're going to be building a course that can be full size for all of the new, or all of size crawlers, really. Yes, all size crawlers. So it's going to appear without a course. It's going to look like a huge rock garden that we're going to be able to move stuff around every couple months. We'll change it up and we're going to have uh, one six scale is going to be able to kind of do some stuff out there. Won't be a course for them, uh, but it'll be something they can play on. And we'll get the new G Speed uh, GS6 chassis for the Axial SCS6 coming out probably here in about three, four weeks. Uh, we're waiting on waiting on some uh, supporting parts to come and back for sampling and, and testing. And then, uh, you know, we're going to blow it up. So who are we spotting for? We got Gabriel Fleming with G-Speed Chassis right here. Okay. Class 1. Oh, class 1, Jack, it's coming off, guys. Jack, it's coming off. Hardcore RC, okay. Team G-Speed, JJ's 3D Design. You're looking right. too far ahead. I was. All right, we got this. Stay high side. High side. Straight tires coming through. All right, down. And then down towards top. Yes, yes, yes. Straight tires. Stay wide, stay wide. This is that big valley right here. Stay up on this high side right here. You're good. Stay high, stay high. 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 Okay, now turn. Oh. Smart reverse. Nice choice. Watch that gate. Good job, good job. We got it. Stop time. Oh yeah, baby. 142. Great there job, Gabe. 142, damn. Can I go back <laughs> <in> the <laughs> All right, Gabe. That was a good run, dude. Thank you. I started to say something. Man, I like the pace you had on there. Woo. Way to pick it up, man. Yeah. Uh, uh, how do you feel about your run? Very good, very good. Third quarter, so I got one more to go. So we'll see. I'll get How'd you spot my score. there? Fucking very good. I spot it. We just spot each other through, and he knew what I told him, and he told him, told me the same thing. We work together often. Great job, guys. All right, thanks, man. Number, so number five, fifth place going into finals is James Wyatt. Fourth place going into finals, Wyatt Mellon. Third place going into finals, Jonathan Baskins. Second place, Daisy. And your top driver for the class one today, Nabil. So those drivers get ready, get your trucks ready. And bring them, bring them back over for tech. And then we'll get rolling. Who's number six? That looks like your mama, Bryce Purchase.
<laughs> right, we're all ready to rock and roll. So we just hopped in the VIP shuttle in the finals after class. <laughs> hey, with the GC hey, guys. Yeah. We're all in here. I don't know what's gonna happen, but <laughs> we're about to make it happen. Oh shit! The rental car church. Oh, oh, oh god! Oh, all right, all right. Hey, we're on better on course. Let me do it. Yeah, no, no, no. All right, well, we're about to get there. We're about to get there. We should have seatbelts. <laughs> If things are flowing, you know, I'm not frustrated already. Where are you going to find out? Are you going to find us? Yeah. That's fun, dude. Appreciate it. Fifty driver. Progress, no gate. <laughs> <laughs> it's not your truck. No. no. <laughs> nice. That is not. <laughs> Time? 
Right over. I know we're all. <laughs> we're all just I hungry. think we're all just hungry. Yeah. I got a tumor. Oh, uh, you hit that top gate. I did. You're right. <laughs> Three minutes, driver. I hit past hungry. I'm hungry. Starting to get. Ready to jump back. There you go. All right, I'll see it. Oh. Bold move. Nah, it's a good move. I like it. I'm on now. Nice and slow. Who built that? I know exactly who made that damn gate. Two oh five, bro. Sounds of time. Two six. Nice driving. Nice. Yeah. Very, that was a well thought, very well thought out winch. Watch your head, Thank you. Well, looks like you're gonna be wrapping up Scale Nationals day one. Class one was very exciting, lots of good driving, lots of really fun people out there today. Big congrats to Nabil for taking the wind. And in addition, while I was there, I picked up a few things. Big shout out to Reefs RC. I actually picked up their 99 micro servo for my SEX 24 Gladiator. And I haven't done anything with this 10.3 um, with the portals yet, but I knew a raw 500 is gonna be a great choice. I mean, fully programmable. You're, you're always gonna wanna upgrade. I'm always gonna want more power. I like to push things to the limit. So big shout out to them. Thanks for everybody that put on the event today and stay tuned for class two and class three videos. That's gonna go ahead and wrap things up. So if you liked what you saw, make sure to subscribe, check you on the next one. And I hope to see you guys out there steady crawling on some rocks soon.